I'm soul splitting my health back, like you said. Oh! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Take it! Take it with soul split! Oh, we made it! That was incredible. I'm so glad I did that. No regrets at all. Oh, Codex! Melee Beastmaster for Codexes. Every time. Take my hand And we'll go away To a different place Float on air And we'll hide away I'll be your escape Look up And feel the shifting winds Tossing us around again What the fuck? How's it going guys? It's Ryan here and welcome to episode number 13 of the Road to Max Cash Drop Tab. I wanted to start off this video really quick by saying Angel of Death is out and I camped Angel of Death for like 25 or 30 hours just on the release week, but none of the AOD clips are going to be in this video because before AOD was released, I already had 48 hours of PVM and clips, which I've turned into this episode. So anyways, all the AOD stuff will be in episode 14, which should be out in a couple weeks. Now for the sake of not spoiling things, I'm not going to talk about anything I got at the Angel of Death, but if you're dying to know or you want to find find out how much money I made in my first 120 kills, you can go follow me on Twitter, there's a link in the description and I put my at on the screen as well, it's at the RS guy with two Y's. So anyway guys, other than that, I wanted to give you a massive advanced thank you for 13,000 subscribers, that's a really huge milestone and I really do appreciate it. Other than that, hopefully you all have a fantastic day and enjoy the rest of the video. Peace out. Not too bad Zola, how are you man? Ah! Dead. Okay. No, 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 no! Oh, there we go, some Onyx Bolts E. I'm making a testing video right now comparing the Chaotic Spirit and the Zamorakian Spirit to the Miziari, and uh, that's really, really funny. Would you look at that, some Onyx Bolts E. Awesome loot right there. All right, guys, I just did Beastmaster with two accounts at the same time, which was a ton of fun. Absolutely amazing stuff. Um, but yeah, I can't actually loot on my main, unfortunately, but I'm gonna loot on my alt, and you will see the broadcast message if I get anything. Here we go. What's it gonna be? It is gonna be not very much. Some techie, water talismans. Yeah, nothing noteworthy at all. But uh, yeah, that was the thing that happened. Ooh, granite mall drop. If only that was worth anything. Oh well. Great. Oh! Of course. See? Did I not call that? No. Did I not call no. that? I said, as soon as we go from a duo to a trio, <laughs> within like, how many kills is that? Like five or six kills. <laughs> Fucking crap. <laughs> There we go, just finished a Queen Black Dragon Reaper assignment. I actually think that's the first QBD Reaper I've ever done. I think I've just always skipped it since I got the pet, but uh, trying it out now with actual good gear, because I haven't been here since I got the pet like a year and a half ago during Racks from Scratch, uh, it's really, really nice. It's a super convenient boss, and I'm definitely going to do these in the future, just because of how good the money is. Uh, but anyways, let's open this up, grab ourselves like a Vizzy or something, be pretty nice. Uh, no, 200k cash though. No complaints from me. Uh, let's put that in the bank and let's grab ourselves another Reaper. All pile you as soon as any of them pile you. What? Get off me. Dead. Are you kidding me? I'm actually the worst YouTuber of all time. <laughs> okay guys, I just got Vinditti and I thought I was recording, but I wasn't recording. So that's gonna be two drop tab episodes in a row where I forgot to record a pet. And this one's even worse because I didn't even get the screenshot. Okay guys, I'm super disappointed by this, but as you can see on the screen, I actually managed to get myself the Imbued Blade Slice drop, which is the Venditti pet, and I'm on 573 kill count, and I've actually managed to get both of the Vindicta pets, which is absolutely insane. Uh, but yeah, I'm just really upset I forgot to record. It just totally slipped my mind. I thought I was recording, and then I clicked on OBS, and it said I wasn't recording. And yeah, a little bit of sadness there. I really do apologize, but yeah, the best I can do is... Uh, Show you guys the pet, show you guys the chat message and all that stuff. Uh, I even clicked on the blade slice, that's how sure I was that I was recording. Uh, but yeah, anyway guys, that's another pet. So three pets in the last two drop tab episodes. That's absolutely ridiculous. Would you look at that? We got, the, 
We got the Sam. No, we got the Dank Bow. Look at that co-op Slayer. We did Abbey Demons, got an Abbey this Whip. Pretty fun. Soon as it's soon easy. as we get to the Dank Beasts, it's uh, it's Dark Bowman mode. This is just it's beautiful. It's what a time to be alive. My Reckless Aura is about to wear off, so that's gonna be the last Rack skill of the evening. Just doing four tonight, and I'll move on to do some next or something else. Let's check the loot. Oh my. Okay, this is the last kill of the Reaper assignment. Honestly, that Reaper assignment took me three minutes to do. It's that quick. 10k Slayer experience, nine Reaper points. Oh, and we got some brews. Oh no, I'm lagged. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh no, I'm gonna die. I am 100% dead here. Oh shit, eat the food, put in the food, put in the food. Oh! Dragon Hatchet coming in, 1.4 mil made. I'm not on a Slayer task or anything, I'm just doing uh, doing some DKs for fun. Had about half an hour of downtime, and this is my preferred boss just to go to for a little bit of time. There's no kill count, the instance is really cheap. Uh, definitely one of my favorite bosses in the game, and I still have one DK's pet left to get, so really, it's a win-win, and uh, Dragon Hatchet. There we go, second kill of the Reaper assignment. We actually got ourselves some boots of subjugation. I got off the perfect sunshine rotation that kill, and uh, that's not too bad. Here we go, last kill of the Death's assignment. That was a really, really good one, really, really smoothly done, and uh, we get ourselves 15k Sarah experience as well as 18 Reaper points. Four! Not gonna swear, two in a row. Four man Rago kill. I think that's my first time doing a proper four man. Ooh. Oh, did we just get a sing? Wow, we, I was paying no attention. I was just looking, I was marveling at the fact that I got two loot piles and the sing split. What's that split four ways? 28.7 mil, are you kidding me? Wow, easy boss. First kill of the testing video, and we actually managed to get ourselves some Onyx Bolts E. Awesome stuff there. When the RDD comes in, rip. I always freak out for the royal pieces, and everyone gives me shit for it. I just like that it's a unique item I can put in the drop tab. I know it's only worth, like, I don't even want to know what they're worth now. Probably, like, 75k, if not less. Oh, 89k. You know what? That could be worse. Last QB to kill down, as I almost kill myself with tendrils. Wouldn't that have been great? 10k Sayer experience, 9 Reaper points. Not too bad. We're going to grab the loot. And then probably go to Rax? I'm thinking Rax. I haven't had a leg piece in like, I want to say two months. So definitely time to go to Rax. What's in the coffer? Oh, another royal piece. Look at that. Back to back royal sights. Awesome way to end the death task. Throw those in the tab and let's head to Rax. This onslaught was way better time than the last one. Oh, as he manages to die anyway. Now that was not nearly as terrible as the last time. Should get the kill down before the acid core touches us. Yep. Uh, so yeah, we've got five more Rax skills to do on the Reaper. Let's grab the loot. Oh, there we go! Spider leg bottom, finally! I say finally because in 720-ish kills, I've had seven leg pieces. So uh, yeah, I'm really happy with that. Awesome stuff. So now I'm two thirds of the way to finishing another spider leg. Oh, there we go, cannonball drop. Guys, that was my best Telos P5 ever, and it wasn't even close. Look at all the food I had left. I barely had to drink any brews. That was just, everything went perfect. That was so good for me. Uh, I'm still learning this boss, and I've basically just been doing single 100% kills, but that kill was so good that I actually think I might want to start streaking now. That was just incredible. Nothing went wrong. The only thing I messed up on was the so much power in the P4, but everything else was done perfectly. And that P5, I didn't panic at all. I was cating at the right times, and that was just absolutely brilliant. Uh, so what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna continue the challenge, and then tomorrow when I get up, I'm gonna continue. Okay, first Araxor kill down with the Miziari. I'm just working on a testing video right now, and that was actually really good. I used like six food in the whole kill, and I think I did Araxi without using a single food. Uh, so yeah, let's check the loot. Oh, we just got the middle! <laughs> Miziari, absolutely OP, are you kidding me? I think that was only seven or eight kills after the last leg I got, so the luck is turning around. That's absolutely huge. So now, as you can see in the drop tab, we have two middle legs as well as one spider leg bottom. So all we need is the top leg and we can actually finish ourselves a spooter leg. That is ridiculous. I've never had a stack of more than one of the same type of spider legs. That's absolutely huge. And uh, that just motivates me to keep going on the racks. That's absolutely amazing because we get that one more leg piece and that's another 150 mil in the tab. Holy crap. That's gonna just about do it for this episode of the Road to Max Cash Drop Tab. Hopefully you all did enjoy. The total value of the tab, believe it or not, is 1.75 billion GP. So we made a ton of money this episode, one of the biggest episodes to date, and we're getting really, really close to that Max Cash stack. So anyway guys, that's it from me. Hopefully you all did enjoy. Feel free to leave a like if you did, subscribe, all that good stuff. Have a good one, and peace out.